fatal landslides strike Guatemala. On Sunday, September 5th, an estimated 100 rescuers were buried as they searched for victims of a previous landslide along the Inter-American Highway in the Guatemalan Highlands. Additional rescue teams are working to find those and others who are still missing, with National Coordinator of Disaster Reduction David De Leon saying that the ongoing rain has hindered their efforts. At least 54 people total have perished, with more than 18 missing in the series of tragedies resulting from weeks of rain in Guatemala. Along with extensive damage to structures, the nation's major highway has been blocked by over 30 landslides within 50 kilometers, causing traffic jams up to 75 kilometers long. Declaring a national emergency, President Alvaro Colom stated that the recent intense weather had ruined all the reconstruction work following Tropical Storm Agatha in May and asked Congress to approve emergency funds for rebuilding. Expressing our heartfelt sympathies, Supreme Master Ching Hai offered an initial 15,000 U.S. dollars in aid, an amount that could acquire 134,000 U.S. dollars in emergency supplies if purchased in the United States, based on the cost of living in Guatemala. She also requested that our association's relief team or nearby association members please go as soon as possible to help the disaster victims and bereaved. She also said that any extra funds would be made available as necessary. We thank President Colum and all personnel working to help the rain afflicted, as well as Supreme Master Ching Hai for her caring assistance to the vulnerable. With our sympathies to those who have lost loved ones, we pray that such extreme conditions be lessened with our better care for fellow beings and the environment.